evening, everyone. The beginning of Friday Night Lights marks an exciting time for a high school athlete. New at 11, it also marked a milestone for one football official. News Channel 9's Madison Moore takes us behind the scenes of a referee's first varsity game. As Brian Leonard ran across the football field Friday night, it wasn't his first time, having played the game in high school and officiating the past two years. I just love football. just want to be part of the game. You know, my personal schedule doesn't really allow me to coach. Can't be at practice every day. And this is the best way to get involved. But it was his first time refereeing a varsity game, and it's no easy task. The common person kind of watches the game, and they think they have the gist of, oh, I know this, I know that rule. But when you really pick up the rule book and see everything that's in there, it, you kind of got to take a step back and just take it page by page. The job requiring hours of studying and practice, but potentially the most valuable lessons have come from veteran officials who Leonard gets to learn from on and off the field. Who can advance and when? Can't advance. I'm off. Has to be a fumble. Can't advance. Yes. The pregame meeting providing last minute refreshers before the officials take the field. I'm with guys who have experience, and if I have a question, they've lived it. Once the meeting is wrapped up, Leonard says he doesn't have any specific game day rituals, but he always makes sure to get a good stretch in, so he's ready to go when the whistle blows. <laughs> And with a severe referee shortage, Leonard is going into his first varsity season sooner than normal. There's a need, you know, and there's a need, and I'm more than happy to fill that need. As for the increase in fan hostility? There's no reason to get involved in that. It's a lose-lose situation. Instead, channeling his passion for the sport into making good calls. In Homer, Madison Moore, News Channel 9.